Right, we're on. Welcome to the channel. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're a current subscriber, welcome. Today, launching driver. I mean launching driver. Let's get the ball airborne. Before we start, click the subscribe button if you've not already done so. Also the bell notification for instant notifications. And of course the thumbs up button. That shares it around YouTube. That works for me. So launching driver, that's today. We're going to launch this driver. We're going to get angle of attack being a positive one because that's what we need. We're going to focus on the chest of the player and the address position of the golf club. So to hit driver well, there's a couple of things that have to happen. Angle of attack needs to be positive. So the angle of the golf club coming into impact has to be a positive one. Golf ball, angle of attack negative, angle of attack positive. It has to be positive to get the launch up. So we're going to keep it really simple. Two simple things to do. Take your address position with the golf ball. Okay, right hand goes down right side or trail hand down trail side and then it's applied on the aft of the golf club, the back of the golf club. Trail hand down, applied to the aft of the golf club, not applied on top because right shoulder gets high or trail shoulder gets high. There, into there, good, good. <laughs> now what does that do? Well, when I address this golf ball here, watch the shoulder, the right shoulder, the trail shoulder there, see how it goes down. Now my lead shoulder's a lot higher. Now that angle there that I've created with my shoulders is the angle of attack. So it gives me a reference, a feeling. When I come through impact from that address position there, my lead shoulder and lead hip start to go upwards. And again, encourage an angle of attack. And now there's even more of an angle of impact with the shoulders. We swing up the shoulder line. In doing so, the chest should point towards the sky. If we get the chest to the sky, the body's opened up angle of attack is positive. Dress position, right hand down, on aft of club, left shoulder's high. Back, like normal, good turn, right hips turned away, coming through into impact. As I come into impact there, my chest goes up to sky, so my chest starts to point skyward, therefore my lead shoulder and lead hip have also gone up, and from there, angle of attack becomes positive, and then we launch driver. That's great, Steve. I totally understand it. But why have you got a row of golf balls and tees down there? Well, this is it. So I have four golf tees in place that are one golf ball apart. There's my object ball that I'm going to hit and I'll take these three away. So now I have three tees right down my target line. So my object ball plus three tees right down my intended target line. And the object now is to incorporate everything we talked about, about right hand or trail hand onto aft of shaft lead shoulder, lead hip and chest going up towards sky and if I play this shot I want to ensure that I only take perhaps one tee away I do not want to take that third tee away if I take third tee away my angle of attack is super negative if I come down here with right shoulder high or trail shoulder high in here and I blast all these tees away that's that's horrendous stop playing golf <laughs> don't stop playing golf sorry that's a lie it's a hard game We'll have to get better, keep playing golf. So line myself up, my tees are down my target line, so I have a reference. Great. Address position. Good. Right hand down. Now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to move the club head two golf balls behind the actual golf ball. Two golf ball widths behind the golf ball. So two golf balls behind the original golf ball, which is going to encourage low point to be there. Then the angle of attack will be positive from there. So moving those away. Address position, move my two golf balls behind, down, on the aft as I come through, left shoulder, left hip and chest to the sky, angle of attack will be positive, starting here, it's a really really good drive, I've not hit one tee, i never even hit one, angle of attack had to be positive, that felt great. That felt absolutely brilliant. I'm going to do another one. So these tees are all at the same height. Dress position. Two balls behind. Right hand down. Right hand on. Angle of attack positive. Chest to the sky. I feel as though when I've turned through, it's a, it's a, it's a lateral rotation. So I've turned through the impact. I feel as though my chest points more skywards than it does downwards so here to here good starting behind really good as well so I took away one of the tees plus my object tee 
but I hit it pretty well. So angle of attack, not as positive on that one. Probably a little bit more neutral, but I wasn't hitting one, two, three, four tees. I took two tees away, which is good. Make sure you take no more than two tees. The object tee, which is the one the golf ball's on, plus your first tee. We'll set one up again. So four tees, it's dead simple. Tee your ball up how you normally would. Good. Visualise, sorry, there's your ball. Boom. One goes there. Make sure it's down your target line. One goes there. And one goes there. And your ball goes back on its tee. And you're set to go. You'll eventually get to a position where you can lose this tee altogether. Set up. Happy with that. Back. Through chest to sky. Good. Oh, it's the best yet. And again, nothing's moved. I might have just touched that wee guy. <laughs> that is... Uh, that is the drill.